Whoa, 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 stop, stop, ah, oh, Dizzy. What a great test drive. Yes, but slow down, slow down, oh, oh whoops. Hello, fresh boy, what are you doing hiding behind me? <laughs> Nothing, just being silly. You did a great job at your checkup here at the clinic. I was brave. Yes, you were, little fresh boy. So do we get to go have our picnic now? Oh, yes, I'm a little worried though. Got this big basket and we've walked so far away already. Oh, now we've got more walking to do. I'm tired. I know. It's tough when you get those checkups. And carry me. Oh, I can't carry you and the basket. And carry me. Oh, this is no good. I think we need a car. That will help us get to the places we need to go much faster. Especially now that I've got two of you. Yeah, sister and brother. I think there's a car dealership just next door. Let's go over there and check it out. Oh yeah, let's get a fancy new sports car. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Oh, I don't think that's gonna be good for all three of us. How about a big, big truck? Yeah, uh, not a big truck for you little ones. I'm sure we'll find something just right. Let's go, grab our things. Would you like to see our fresh family get a new car? Then hit the thumbs up button. Oh my goodness. So many vehicles to choose from here. Come on, kiddos. We're coming, we're coming. <laughs> you silly tag, you're it. No, no, you're it. <laughs> okay, okay, we're in the store now. We need to be on our best behavior. Okay. Whoa. Look at all these cars here. There's so many. We will ride in all of them. Yeah, ride, 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 ride. Hang on, hang on. We'll just try riding in the one we think we like. Hmm, we may need someone to help us go through all these cars though and find the best one for us. Did someone say they needed help? Where? Oh, oh my goodness, what's that? A scary giraffe. Oh no, I'm so sorry I startled you. Oh, oh hi there. Yeah, hi. Are you a real giraffe? No, I'm just Riptide. I'm working here at the car dealership today. Oh, how nice. But your shirt says Toys R Us. Yes, well, they closed. I still really like the shirt though. Oh. Back to you guys. I hear you're looking for a vehicle? Yes, you see I've got my little sister and little brother now. Oh, hello there. Hi. And sometimes we have a long way to go and I just can't walk there. They want to be carried. All that stuff. So we need something that's big enough for the three of us. I completely understand. Why don't we go ahead and take a look at this vehicle I was just in. Oh, Jeep? Yes, it is a Jeep. It can go anywhere. These tires are made to go where you need to go. I think it might help you. Well, that does sound good. Hop in. Hmm, it's a nice fit. I want to get in. I want to get in. I'm going in the back. Yay, let's ride back here. Woohoo. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work. I need space for both of them to be inside the car. And without the windows and roof, it just doesn't seem quite safe enough for us. Oh, I should have known. Absolutely. Okay, the Jeep is out. Let's keep looking. Well, here you have it. You wanted space? I've got you space. Plenty of room in this camper van. A camper van? No, no, no. That's way too much space. I need something smaller that we can keep at our house. Aww. But maybe there's a pool or a slide. I'm afraid not. This just isn't practical. Hmm, I'm not doing very well here. No, no, it's fine. I, I want to see everything. Okay, so this one was just too big. We need to find you something smaller, right? Yes, please. I've got it. What color car do you think our fresh family will get today? Will it be red, blue, or pink? Put your guess in the comments. Whoa, sissy, sissy, look at this adorable little car. It's so cute. I think it's just my size. Yes, well, it's very cute, but please be careful in there. This isn't for little sisters. I know, I know. Whoa, 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 stop, stop. Ah, sissy. I've got it, I've got it. Whoa, come back here. Oh, uh oh, are you all right? Yes, I'm fine. You out of there. Okay, and no more cars for me, right? That's right. Uh, I guess we can say that this one's probably not right for you. No, no thank you. So why don't you take a look at this beautiful model. Sleek design, performance tires, convertible top, now tell me you wouldn't want to drive this around. Oh, I would. It sure is nice. You've got to sit in it. It's got leather seats. It feels so comfy. Well, I guess I could just sit in it. Yeah, sissy, convertible, convertible. How's it feeling? Feels great, but there's no back seat. Yeah, where am I supposed to sit? 
Oh, that's too bad. I was forgetting you had a little sister and a little brother. Yes, as nice as this is, and I do love this sporty car, it's not right for our family. Ah, of course, a family vehicle. Now I know which direction to point you in. This has just got to be the right car for you. Yeah, you think so? Okay, you get to be up front in this driver's seat, and then take a look back here. You've got this bench seat, another bench seat in the back with car seats, Plus, it folds down back there. My goodness, this does have a lot of space, which is wonderful. So you'll take it then, huh? I'm afraid not. Huh? How could this not be right for you? Well, while I do have a little sister and a little brother, that's it. You've got three seats in the back, three spaces up front, and then the driver and the passenger here. That's way more than I need. Hmm, this is difficult. Finding someone a car is not as easy as I thought it would be. Look, don't give up. You're doing a great job. I've seen so much, and I know what I want and what I don't want. So, you need space, but not too much space. Now you've got it. Oh boy. Um, all right, I'm gonna get this one pulled away and then try to find you something else. That sounds good. Wow, this looks like it would be so much fun to ride. Obviously not good for having a little sister and brother, though. Maybe I could just see what it would be like to ride it. Eh, maybe even just sit on it. Wow, this is a good fit. It would be so much fun to ride this around town all by myself, but uh, not what I need. Stay focused, Fresh. Okay, just a quick test drive. Woohoo! This is too much fun! Dizzy, wait for me! Hey, you were going without me. I know, I know, I was just going for a test drive. Aw, but where are we supposed to go? Yeah, I was just doing it for fun. We can't get this one. Fresh, Fresh, are you here? Yes, yes, I'm here. I think I have a couple of excellent choices for you. Here's a car. We've got two seats in the front, two seats in the back. That's a good number. Same here. Um, is this Vampirina's car? Yes, it is. I thought you might like something like it. Okay, um, nice thinking, but I don't want Vampirina's car. People might think I'm her. Okay, so this one? Riptide, it's a police car. Uh-huh. I'm not a police officer. I can't be riding around in a police car. Hmm, that does make sense. We probably shouldn't be selling this, huh? No, I think the police probably need it back. Yeah. Oh, I feel like just giving up. No, 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 you're doing a great job. But I don't think there's any other cars around here for you. Really? Not one? Well, there was someone taking out another car for a test drive. I suppose you could see that one. Yeah, I want to see everything. Here she comes now. Okay, you can stop there. Ooh. Oh, thank you. Um, so are you gonna buy this car? No, I think it's more space than I need. It's just me. I could use something smaller. Huh, you know what's really fun is that moped that's back there. I drove it around a little. It was great if you're just one person. <gasps> that does sound like fun. Thanks, I'll check it out. No problem. So this is it, huh? That's right, this is our cutie car. Oh, cutie car, I like the way that sounds. Yes, it's pink. We've got purple wheels, a white interior. You've got some space in the front and the back for storage. How wonderful. I see there's a front and back seating. Uh-huh, should be just the right amount for you. What do you think about me taking this for a test drive? Really? You like it that much? I think I do. All right. I am going to have to go with you, though, since you haven't bought the car. Uh, of course, of course. Just taking it for a test drive. Come on, kiddos. Hop in. Yay. Woohoo. Make space. Wait, wait, wait. Can you guys wait for me? Come on, girl. What are you doing here? Well, actually, I was just hoping for a ride to work. Um, well, I'm just going for a test drive. Would you mind? Uh, no, that'd be all right. Oh, thanks so much. You're a lifesaver. Excuse me, kid. Well, it's a little tight right now, but we're all in. And normally, it would just be the three of us. All right, get that engine started. Let's head out of here. You got it. Whoa. What a great test drive. Yes, but slow down. Slow down. Ah! Oh, whoops, sorry. I must have hit the gas instead of the brake. Well, let's check out and check the damage. Oh, good, doesn't look like there's any damage here. Thank goodness, I wouldn't have wanted to buy a car that was damaged. I wouldn't have wanted one to sell. Huh, let's check out the front here so you can see how much space there is. Whoa, that's great. Hey, maybe our picnic basket will fit in there. Just need to close it up. I think it'll work. Let me show you the trunk. See, it even comes with a spare tire. <gasps> how convenient. So what do you think? Is this the car for you? Yes, indeed. I'll take it. Woohoo! I've done it. I've sold a car. Hey guys, I'm still supposed to get to work. Oh yes, and we have a picnic to get to. Will you enjoy this fabulous car? Did you guess that Fresh would get a pink car? 
If so, say I got it in the comment. All right, off we go. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my goodness, we almost had another accident. What is it, Shorty? Well, uh, I think I'm getting a new job at a clinic today. I, I don't want to be late. Could you drop me off there? What did you say? You're going to be working at a clinic? I hope so. Can you take me? Definitely. Come on. You can just drop me off in front, okay? I'll walk in on my own. Got it. Oh, goody, goody, goody. I might just get a chance to work at a clinic. This is so exciting. Hello? Knock, knock. Hello? Doctor? Coming. Oh, uh, yes, how can I help you? Hi, I'm Shorty, and I'm ready to work here at your clinic. Oh, well, that's so super duper nice of you, but I'm afraid there's just no more space here. Oh, really? Yes, I've got all the help I need. Oh, that's too bad. Uh, are you sure there's nowhere else you can go? Hmm, well, I have always had a dream of opening my own hospital. Ooh, that does sound nice. I had a dream of opening this clinic. Wow, maybe I could do it. You know, I'd love a hospital next door. <gasps> that's it then, that's it. I'm gonna build my very own hospital. Good luck to you. Okay, thanks again. Well, let's take a look over here. Oh yes, there's plenty of space for a hospital. This is right where I'll build it. It'll be perfect next to the little clinic. It'll be a place for emergencies. Let's help Shorty's dream come true. We'll help by starting to build her hospital. Here is the floor of our hospital. I think she's gonna need some cabinets, places to keep things like medicines and stuff like that. We'll go right over here. Perfect. Doctors need to wash their hands all the time, so we'll be putting in a little sink. I've got a wall here. It's got a window that can open and close for fresh air. And then there's a door on the side. We will set that into place. Good. Oh, it's really starting to come together. I think we're gonna need a bed in here for patients. That looks good. Maybe a little side table to keep water and things. And a cozy little blanket. And here I'll store some of the medicines. I'm also going to add a support wall here. And one here that has a nice little eye chart on it. It's the letters of the alphabet. They get smaller and smaller. Can you read them? There's another very important room here. Okay, we'll get this little piece put in. And on top of that goes our stretcher, emergency patients. Now on this side, we're gonna create a little drive up area for the ambulance. They need special parking, special areas right next to the hospital for those super emergency patients. My goodness, it's coming together so quickly. It looks great. Places for patients, emergency places to take care of patients. Oh boy, I can't wait to see what else we do at the place. That's right, we do have more, Shorty. We need to go up a level. In order to do that, we've got to lay down. Oh, we're gonna do it over here. Let's see, get it into place. Sometimes takes a little wiggling. We're gonna put it over here as the cover for our ambulance drive up also. Okay, that's looking really nice. Some walls need to go in here. Little door out to a patio area and window. Patients love to be able to see outside, get some fresh air. We have a little seat for a visitor. Another bed, kind of a little pediatric room because we're gonna put a little blanket with bears on it here and another piece for the wall. Over the ambulance drive up, we're gonna put our little hospital sign so people know that they're coming to a hospital. Let's finish things up over here. They definitely need a roof over our emergency patient check area. Okay, I think I've got it in. And we're just gonna add a roof here. We've already got the sides on it. There is a little door to open up. A nice red roof we will put into place. Make sure it's secure in there. We're just about done with our hospital. We just need to finish up the roof over this patient's room. We don't want it raining in on them, of course. So I'll put a little roof piece down. We'll add some of these red and white dormers and a couple decorative pieces on either side and a little rail across the top. I just don't believe it. I don't believe it. My dreams come true. I actually have my very own hospital. Wait a minute. I can't look like this in my own hospital. Here we go. We've got you some scrubs here. 
It is something that doctors and nurses wear around a hospital. Oh, this is much better, much, much better. Meow Cutie, Meow Cutie, where are you going? We've just got a call in. Somebody's been hurt at the McDonald's. Oh no, hurry, I'm off. I hope everyone's okay. Well, I think I've got a couple patients to check on. Hi there, Malibu baby, it's Dr. Shorty. How are you feeling today? Uh, still a little tired. I'm sure you are. You took quite a fall yesterday. All right, I'd like to show you what happened. Here's your x-ray. See the broken bone? We're gonna have to cast your arm. Oh no, is it going to hurt? Actually, not at all. It will just help the bone heal safely. Okay, give me just a moment. I'm gonna wash up in the sink over here. Now you'll need to hold very still. Yes, doctor. There we have it, you're all done. Oh my goodness, that was so fast. I told you it wouldn't be a problem. Lux will bring something for Malibu Baby later. What do you think it will be? Flowers, candy, or balloons? Put your guess in the comments. All right, since you're all settled, I'm gonna go check on another patient. Yes, doctor. Well, unicorn curious cutie, how you feeling? Actually, I'm getting my energy back now. Yeah, do you really need to be in the unicorn costume? Oh, I guess I was just wearing it because it was cheering up the little sisters. Yes, I can see they would like that. And I like that you're helping them feel better. Yeah, I think it's helping me feel better too. Well, you're almost all better from your sickness. It doesn't seem like you have any more cough or sneezing. Nope, just every once in a while. You look so much better. Yes, thank you for all your help, doctor. I was just wondering if I could go out and get some fresh air. Certainly, there's a patio right over here through this door. All right, we'll just go through here. Oh, I just love all the fresh air and you can see so far from up here. Yep, you just have to be careful. Oh yes, of course. Oh my, what's all that noise? I think it's the ambulance. I better go check and see what's going on. Help, help, please, I need someone's help. We're here, we're here, we're here. Ambulance, into the drive-thru. Okay, okay, I've got you. Oh, let me get the stretcher. Here, here, here. All right, out you go. All right, what is it that happened? I fell in the kitchen at McDonald's. Oh, no. All right, I think my leg might be broken or something. Come on, come on, I'll get you this way. Into our emergency room. I'm gonna need another doctor in here. I'm here, I'm here. Check her vitals. Okay, heartbeat is good. Breathing seems regular. All right, I'm gonna take a look at the leg. Ow, ow, ow! Oh yes, I think it's definitely broken. You're gonna have to stay off of it. Oh, Here, we do have some medicine for you to help your leg feel better. Just take a couple. Okay. All right, I'll have some nurses come take you to your room. You're probably gonna have to use a wheelchair for a little while. Oh no, I won't be able to work. It's gonna have to heal. This is terrible, just terrible. How am I gonna get around in a wheelchair? It's really no problem. You'll probably find that it can be a little fun too. Really? Oh yeah, wheel around, carry your friend. Just be careful. Oh, I never thought about it like that. Oh, still hurts, huh? Yeah, a bit. Don't worry, we'll get you all fixed up. Thanks, Doc. Malibu baby, are you sleeping? Huh? Oh no, I guess I was just drifting off into a daydream. Hoping that I could go home soon. I think maybe you can. Hey, I brought you something. Really what? Just a second. I brought you some Get Better Soon balloons. Oh, I love balloons and they're red. They're so beautiful. But here you go. Wow, kind of hard for me to hold them right now. Yeah, I guess I should have thought of that. Is that a picture of your broken bone? Yeah, kind of neat that you have that. I guess so, I hadn't thought about it that way. I sure did kind of have to walk a long ways to get here. Yeah, do you need to sit down? Actually, I, I really need to use the restroom. Oh, um, I know there's a sink here, but I don't know about a bathroom. Oh, what am I gonna do? How will I find one? Oh, doctor, doctor, doctor. Yes, can I help you? Are you okay? Actually, I just need to use the restroom, the potty, please. Where is it? Oh, it's up on the second floor. Oh, excuse me. Oh, not here. Excuse me. Excuse me, coming through. Just looking for the bathroom. Oh, sorry, there's not one in here. Oh, are you kidding? Uh, hopefully there's one over here. Yes, finally! Oh, thank goodness, just in time. Oops, let's close the door. Well, I know you guys got some bandages, but I think you're ready to go home. I'm so thankful this hospital was here. Yeah, me too. And I'm so glad I could help. Guess what, guys? I get to go home too. Oh, you're so lucky. Plus, you get to walk out of here. 
Yep, I think maybe I have a couple of going home gifts for you. Really? Yep, how about a happy meal from McDonald's? Ooh, I do like that. Thanks. Sure, no problem. And what about me? Aha. Uh -huh. How about a La Loopsie mini doll? <gasps> I love those. They're so pretty. Here's our La Loopsie mini. Let's open it up. Can't wait to see which one Malibu Baby got. She got balloons today and a La Loopsie mini. Hmm, okay, bunch of surprises to pull out. So I'll start with the first one. And it's our doll. <gasps> What a pretty, pretty light pink she is. Okay, we need to add some accessories to her. So we'll start with a pretty pink dress, of course. Ooh, it's very fancy. It's very kind of poofy. <laughs> I like those. Sometimes they spin very well. Okay, there we go. She's got her dress on. She's starting to look very lovely. So I'll put out her other accessory. Which is her hair? Ooh, look at this hair. It's in a very nice, fancy, curly updo with a little silver tiara. Pretty, pretty. All right, she's not quite complete yet. So, here we go. We'll take out these pink little shoes. Of course, they're pink, right? And we'll slip those on her little tiny feet. These little tiny shoes. Oh, her outfit is complete, but I believe, yep, she's still got another accessory. What will this one be? It's a pretty little mirror, so she can say, Oh, my hair looks lovely. I'm all ready to go. <laughs> but who is this doll? This is Jewel Sparkle, and she's primp and prep. <laughs> she looks so pretty. Okay, I think I'm ready to go home now. Watch out! Whoa, whoa! Hang on there, guys. Oops, sorry. We're just going to the park. Well, you better be careful on that skateboard or you'll end up here at the hospital. Oh, no, thank you. Be careful on me, Aunt Katie. Meow! Okay, bye! We gotta go to the park. 